fishing industry is one of the most important local industries in Sri Lanka. It is one of the major foreign exchange earning enterprises in the country as well as in the country. Sri Lanka is located in the middle of the Indian Ocean and the vast ocean that surrounds the country has been a great help to the fishing industry. Sri Lanka has traditionally been a major player in the fish trade as an important component of the supply of animal protein to its population. According to survey reports, per capita fish consumption in 2016 was estimated at 31.4 kg per year. This division provides a large number of jobs not only in fishing but also in processing, distribution and trade as well as boat building and maintenance. In 2017, 22,898 people worked in aquaculture, of which 6% of women were part of that workforce. Of the 269,964 people in the fishing industry, 7% were women. Shrimp tuna and ornamental fish grown for export of marine products have become a fast-growing subsector. In 2017, the total value of fish and fishery products exports was US$256 million. The value of fish imports in the same year was US$229 million. By the year 2021, the fishing industry in our country has suffered a slight setback. The main reason for this is that Sri Lanka has also been severely affected by the Covid epidemic that engulfed the world in 2020. However, it seems that the situation has returned to normal. This is the Paliagoda Central Fish Market Complex. These images are around at 3.30 early morning. The fishing industry is back to normal. Here you can get fish in bulk and on demand, at a price between 30 and 50% lower than the average market price. Due to its location between Watala and Paliadoda, it is easily accessible to anyone. This central fish market complex is open to you from 3 o'clock in the early morning, 